Oh, now open serving Starbucks. They call it gourmet coffee, but they're linked to Starbucks here. See that? Starbucks. Swimming pool, popcorn. Do sit tiny. Look at that. I think the one in the ad, the one they advertise it not is not this do sit tiny. Ah. This is the one. There's the lift. We have gym here. We have gym. Yeah. No, no plants with the koi carp. Very, very dark, isn't it? Oh dear me. Okay. The sun's out. They've got these light. Oh. Maybe. Maybe other. Maybe. We're going to reception. It's nice and cool here. There we go. There's a swimming pool. It's half past one. It's Friday. And we're out treating Annie to lunch. We're at the Dusitani for lunch today. It's an all-you-can-eat buffet. But it's not a buffet, it's table service because they're not running the buffet. So you have a menu and you can choose your main courses. So Annie has chosen ramen. What is this salad? Paco salad. Paco salad. I've got Caesar salad. We've got pickled radish. We've got Annie's obligatory chicken feet. She ordered me some riblets. Okay, with black beans. <laughs> I'll just ask the waitress, where are the black beans? Because the riblets are there, but there's no black beans. They've not come back. Uh, I ordered some rice obligatory rice the rice came cold I do not understand why a five-star resort like the Ducitani can't get the food right I was here a couple of weeks ago and I had for two salad and it was terrible yeah and I wrote to them but they didn't write back to me so I'm back to have a vlog um, but the Futu salad was just lettuce with tomatoes, red cabbage um, and some snowflake biscuits sprinkled across the top. Totally different to what a Futu salad should be with uh, fried pita bread, green cucumber, green onions and it should be a green salad. It's a green Mediterranean salad. But I suppose the Dusitani of... Uh, putting their own swing on it but anyway uh, just to turn around and shock you a little bit more um, Annie's price 900 peso or 899 peso for her food there and uh, mine's 899 peso and you have to clear all your plate if you don't clear your plate I don't know what happens maybe they revert all the meals to a la carte prices but anyway Annie's enjoying her ramen noodle, her chicken feet, and vegetables. She was complaining today that she got up and she couldn't fit into her dress. It kept dropping off of her hips because she's lost weight. Yeah, she's becoming skinny. I don't think she is. I think she looks very, very pretty and very, very sexy, but she doesn't like compliments. I like fat. She likes fat. Yeah, she wants to be gazole. Annie is now struggling with her tofu and tuna ramen. Yeah. She slowed right up. We got some fresh fruit delivered. Oh, look at that. Pineapple is really, really sweet, which is really, really nice. I've got my rice. I ended up with um, caldaretta. Um, 
Kambing. Kambing. You know what kambing is? Goat. Nah. Nah. It's goat. So this is goat. So what you have to deal with is the bones. So here behind my rice is a graveyard of bones. Uh, I did ask about the riblets with the black bean sauce but the waitress hasn't come back to me to explain why there was no black beans in the ribs strange that isn't it maybe the chef forgot to put that ingredient yeah black beans black beans anyway we're having a nice day out Annie's feeling full but it's good because she has elasticated pants on today so they can stretch, stretch. And now we're going to be in the coffee shop over here later, and we're going to go and have a look at some of their pastries and their coffee. Yeah, and we're going to see how that works out. So, overall opinion. So the packo salad. What do you think on the packo salad? The packo salad is nice. But it will taste better at this piece like lime and a little bit of lime. And because what is taco salad? I don't know what you call that vegetable in English. It's like a it's like a pumpkin sprout. Like a pumpkin sprout. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know those things, the vines. Okay. Is that sprout? Sprouts. Yeah, sprouts. Yeah. It's like the bean vine, sprout. Vine sprout. The pumpkins like this, yeah, and, yeah. Then, um, and then there is like those leaves it's from its vines. And yeah. Its vines, this has this. Oh, okay. Thingy. Oh, very good. And, and I don't how? Know what you call that in English? Yeah. Um, pumpkin vine sprouts. What about your uh, tofu and tuna ramen? Mm, ramen so, is okay, but I don't understand why it's a bit sweet. Okay. Ramen should not be sweet. No. Unless you use, well, it'll be sweet if you use the coconut, or put a little bit of coconut in the Okay. Mm -hmm. Just right. like the tom yum. <laughs> tom yum. Tom yum. Okay. And how are, how are your uh, chicken feet? Um, it's just okay. All of the food here is, is just okay. What are the flavors you're looking for on the chicken feet? The original flavor of the braised this one is red, so I don't know what kind of sauce they use, but the taste, like the herbs that they use, is the same. Yeah. But the sauce itself is different. Okay, so it's not giving you that authentic no, it's ad not, it's adobo not. type flavor. It's not the taste of adobo as well, because adobo doesn't have a taste of these um, different herbs. Okay. But the chicken feet, the authentic chicken feet, has this um, the herb taste at the same time the, the well if you say it in Philippine it's like a double but I think the sauce that they use is different okay the so, sauce, so the aromatics that are in the in the sauce are not working for you okay I still eat it <laughs> yeah you do because you think you have to pay extra <laughs> Well, we order it and we still have to pay for it. So we do. We That's okay. Pay. No problem at all. But yeah, overall, all the food are just average. Just average. So it's average for a five-star resort in Davao City. The one we have the best buffet that we had for uh, so far is what we tried. That's what we tried together is in Marco Polo. Marco Polo. But we cannot go there because it's closed. It might open at the end of this year. Even in, even in, where's that? In, in Salon? We yeah. had the buffet there, there with Ravia. Yeah. Mm, it's just a bit. It's, it's okay. not as good as in Marco Polo. There we go. Anyway, so we're here at the Tusitani. You've heard it from Annie. There we go. This is Annie's celebration lunch. <laughs> or one of them, because she's going to school, she's got good results, and I'm very happy. Yeah. She might not be happy, but I don't have to worry about that. 
I'm happy that after year two, she's going to year three. What I find very, very difficult to understand here is how many staff they employ for how many customers. There's a manager over here, look at that, see? Hiding. Looking at her food, food growth profit and her spend. Yeah, oh, look at that, there we go. We're gonna get the bill and we're gonna go and get a coffee over in the coffee shop. We've never eaten in the coffee shop. So if I've got a little bit of room left, they do ice cream here as Annie's just turned around and said. Okay, what are we gonna have? Okay, go on then. What flavors do they do? Vanilla, chocolate, ube, strawberry, strawberry. Oh. Can I have no no ube, just the vanilla, chocolate and strawberry one scoop. Ah, uh, vanilla, ube and chocolate. And then ube lang ube. So ube is a purple ice cream here made from the the root of the yam. It's a yam in English, yeah. Yeah, it's the yam. It's a purple yam. Purple yam, which is a tuba, which is like a potato. So it's potato ice cream, really. They love it here. They love it on their cakes. They love it in their cookies. They love it in their ice cream. They love it everywhere. Their shakes, in their coffee. It's also an early Yeah. It's purple, tastes sweet, with a bit of bit of earthiness behind it, and that's about it. Okay. Like, share, subscribe. So this is um, the coffee shop in Dusitani. Downstairs goes to the Thai restaurant. Got a nice little seating area. My bag is here. Annie's gone to the CR. They do breads and they do coffees and they do cakes. But what I found interesting is they do Starbucks drinks. So they do Starbucks coffee, but the pastries and the cookies and the cakes are brought in from the Dusitani. So yeah, you can buy t-shirts with the Dusitani, uh, or you can sit down and you can chill out, which is what I'm doing here. This chair is really, really big. Look at that. It's comfortable today. It's comfortable. The decor is very, very, very nice. So I had a hot Starbucks coffee and an oatmeal cookie for 249 peso. Very, very nice. Annie, when she comes, she can go and order herself her food or her cookie whatever she's uh, wanting to turn around and do. Outside the window, you can overlook the swimming pool. The swimming pool is four foot, four foot nine deep, but you can't come here as a day guest. You have to book a room and then turn around and you, they'll allow you to lose a swimming pool. There's Antoinette, there we go. Okay, she's back. We're in the Cyan Lounge, which is the Lounge of Waste, Cyan Cyan. Yeah, it means we are wasting food. No, 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 we're just waiting for the taxi. Uh, it's not very busy today here. Very, very nice today. 